Hey guys, thank you for coming to Holidays at the Home Stores. I hope you are all doing well today. In this video, I'm going to show you a detailed close-up look of the latest Halloween wallflower from Bath & Body Works, and also show you a quick demonstration of what it looks like plugged in. I hope you enjoy. So before we jump to the wallflower, I just wanted to give you guys a quick preview of some of the new fall items that I was able to see in my store. So first up, we have the Fox Candle Pedestal. This retailed for $34.95. Next, we have the Cute Critters Water Globe. This retails for $59.95. And these are the Fox Soap Holders, which retail for $24.95. And then just some miscellaneous candle pedestals or candle holders. Some new wallflower plugins. And a couple of pocket back holders. Now I didn't get any of these fall items today, although I think they're adorable. I'm just one of those people that jumps right from Halloween straight to Christmas. I never really decorate too much for fall or autumn. So I don't know, will I pick up any before Thanksgiving? We'll see. So here is the Crystal Ball Wallflower plugin. As I said, it is the latest, and unfortunately I anticipate that it will probably be the last Halloween wallflower that we see this year. You never know, they might surprise us, but if I were to guess, I would say it's going to be the last one, as we do have a lot of new fall stuff coming out right now as well. I know it was highly anticipated. A lot of you were really looking forward to this one releasing, as I was as well. It was online for just a couple of days. Hopefully it will restock soon. And my store just got it in today, so I definitely had to make the trip out there to pick this one up. It retails for $18.50, so it's in that medium price range as far as the Halloween wallflowers go for this year. This one is so beautiful, I think that the price is justified. Some of the other ones, maybe not so much, but I really do love the look of this one. I think it's different as far as anything we've seen for Halloween. I know we've had some other crystal wallflower plugins, but this one just looks great in my opinion. So as far as the design itself, the background of the crystal ball is completely mirrored and then you have the plastic dome on the outside. So I do apologize if there is any distracting reflection or glare, but unfortunately that's just kind of unavoidable. So inside the crystal ball, we have some larger translucent amethyst colored crystals that have an iridescent sheen to them. And then below that, there's a cluster of smaller crystals that are a lighter shade of purple and those have a metallic finish. It is sitting on a really ornate, beautiful base I wouldn't call it a true black, but it's definitely not the lighter gunmetal color that we've been seeing on a lot of the other Halloween items this year. I hope you can see that the base does have a spider web design on it. That's on each side of the rhinestone that's in the middle. That is an iridescent purple color and it does have a raised beaded border around that. So again, just a very beautiful wallflower in my opinion, but let's see the real magic when this thing is plugged in and lit up. Now, before we get that wallflower plugged in, I did want to give you guys a look at another item I purchased today. This is the Spiderweb Car Fragrance Clip. Now, this has the same design as the bat one that you may have seen in a previous video of mine to where you can use it as either a visor or a vent clip, which I absolutely love. I hope they continue with that. It is that same clip closure. So I think we have completely gone away from the twist closure, which I love. It retails for $8.50 and the design is pretty simple. You just have that gunmetal web, which has a beaded raised uh, texture to it. Uh, the majority of the spider is that same color. And then the body, you have that purple iridescent rhinestone, which is the same thing we just saw in the center of the base of that wallflower. So this is another great option for a car fragrance clip for Halloween this year. All right, I've got the tags off. Let's get this thing plugged in. This is going to be the first time for me seeing it as well, so I'm excited to see what it looks like. And there you have it. That's what it looks like in the light. Again, sorry about all the reflection. <laughs> now let's get the lights out and see what it looks like. Well, that magical glow definitely comes through in the dark. This thing looks absolutely amazing. It is picking up pretty true to sight in the camera. 
The purple might be a little darker, maybe a little bit more vivid in person, but it's doing a pretty good job. The wallflower fits tightly in the outlet, which I like. I hate when they're kind of so heavy that they pull away from the outlet, especially their projector ones. But again, I hope any of you that are wanting to get this wallflower are able to get your hands on one. If you have any questions or if I can help you out in any way, just leave a comment below. I really appreciate you all watching and I'll hope to see you next time on Holidays at the Home Stores. Thank you.